So I've got this awesome lesson in customer service. Um, so I, what, Thursday actually, not Friday. Oh, I had picked up one of Infuse Hydrations, Infuse's, oh, Hydro units. And I had basically picked it up from a third party rather than straight from their website. And so this third, this store was selling one of their older units. So I was trying to get it to work over the weekend and I just couldn't. I was having problems with it. <clears throat> so I emailed them and then I've really got nothing back and being impatient and wanting to be able to work on a video with it. Oh, I should, I figured out that their offices were in Logan, which is like right down the road from me. So I showed up basically just barely. Well, I just got out of there like 10 minutes ago, but I kid you not, like the first thing that he's like, I'm sitting there, it's like, okay, so I bring it in, the dude looks at it and he's like, oh yeah, it's like one of our older units. So basically, first, let's see if it works. It just kind of like doesn't work right off the bat like it has been the whole weekend. But basically, he's like, so here's what we're going to do. We're going to update your system, first of all. So he basically goes through the thing that he does in the YouTube video um, that they have about the system. And it's like, so if we roll this over here, you can see that there's this micro hole. We basically move that to the cartridge itself. So when you look at the updated cartridge versus the old cartridge, oh, there is a little rubber piece that has a hole in the lid, a micro hole, to allow air to get in so that the, inf the hydro unit can do the infusion. So... He's like, so what we did is like, there's this little micro hole and he like tries to show it to me. It's like, I can barely see already anyway, but it's whatever. Um, and so he's like, trying to manage that sucks. And so he nonchalantly tosses the one I had paid $45 for, for an item that costs $25 on their website and just nonchalantly tosses it into the trash. And then he's like, so what we're going to do is, and then take this and put that on. So it's the new one, the updated one without the micro hole in the seal, but on the cartridge instead. And so it's like, okay, does that work? Okay. So then I remember, wait, nope. Got to turn the flavor off so that I can get water through. And then we turn it all the way on and pump it through. And it's like, okay, flavors coming through. And it's like, yeah, there we go. So I pop off the cheapo um, bite end that they have on it because they kind of get whatever. And they expect you to replace that, oh, end anyway with something better. But in the process, it's like part of the process I explain, it's like, yeah, I went through like three quarters of my flavor cartridge just trying to prime it with that old unit and he's like oh yeah and so I walk so I walk out with a replacement unit which they said they would do on basically the um support the leaflet that they have with the unit and I also walk out with a whole bottle of their flavor elixir to in essence replace what I had and it's like so here you are, you're basically, you basically tossed money into the trash and you basically gave, spent more money on me than you needed to, but that's to keep a happy customer. And there are a lot of businesses still that don't follow that, but it's just, it I mean, it was kind of what I was hoping for, but I didn't expect it to happen that way at the same time. I expected a little bit more resistance, but it was just so, 
such a smooth process, it really shocked me. Uh, here I am, I walk in, I literally like no appointment. I just kind of walk in, say hello, get someone's attention, mention my issue, and I like bring my backpack in with my stuff, and it's like, and it takes like less than 10 minutes, the drive, takes less than the drive it took for me to go up to get my glasses refitted and back to like solve the issue and it probably cost them more than it cost me but at the same time if they they it's pretty it's pretty good chance that like well I mean you provide that good customer service and um, that customer will scratch your back like I am right now <laughs> So, I mean, I, I'm gonna, I plan on doing a more in-depth video, but like straight off the bat, I would ha like just like they've got water bottles that they do and stuff like that. They've even got lids to put on your Nalgene bottles. So you can literally get a lid that you stick onto a bottle that you already have and just whatever. And I'm excited to actually try out this hydro unit with um, the Tang O water enhancer that I picked up too. So I'm looking forward to that. But yeah. Um, it would be nice to get sponsored by them one day. But oh, what's the word I'm looking for? Yeah, um, if it's... It's not very helpful, but at the same time it is. It helps some people, but yeah, remember your customer support. The customer is the one who's either gonna make or break you, <laughs> your business, and if you treat your customer right, even if they're wrong, if you can treat them in the right way and let them know that they're wrong and help them have a good experience at the same time, then that's really what will make or break your business. And make, yeah, but anyway, Discord and everything else, support links and whatnot, very helpful. I will see you all later.